Despite what the talking heads on the boob tube might tell you, Americans are not in favor of an assault weapons ban. Welcome back to The Gun Collective. My name is John Patton, and the fight for gun rights continues. For the last couple decades, more and more Americans have been coming to their senses and pulling their support for a ban on freedom. According to Gallup polls, since the year 2000, when 59% of the country supported a ban, that number has slowly decreased down to 36% in 2016. The following year, in October of 2017, Gallup poll said that the United States were split on supporting an all-out ban on what they refer to as assault weapons. This data was actually published 16 days after the attack in Las Vegas, which we can only assume is the reasoning for the sudden rise in support. There are a ton of factors that go into that, but the really interesting thing is that only a year later, the numbers had almost normalized yet again. In October of 2018, the number of Americans in support of a ban was 40%, while the number against such a ban was 57. The remaining 3% were not reported. If we take a look at this from a couple different angles, we start to see some confirmation of what some of you might have already suspected. In that same polling, Gallup collected other info, including political party. As it turns out, with the latest data, only 56% of Democrats support such a ban, with 38% of independents and 25% of Republicans in favor as well. Think about that for a second. If only a small amount over half of Democrats support the ban, perhaps we're not fighting as Democrats versus Republicans like many folks think. We are fighting against an entirely different breed here. One of the other points they published was the opinion of folks that have guns in their households. As it turns out, 46% of households without guns are in favor of a ban, and 33% of households with guns also support a ban. What comes to mind are folks that say things like, I have a gun, but, or I know a guy with a gun and he totally, uh, yeah that kind of garbage. It's honestly something I don't think we're prepared for. We have to start understanding that, at least according to this information, we're not just fighting a political party. We're not just fighting someone who has never held a gun and is blind to the reality. We're not just fighting someone who has a fundamental hatred for the foundation of our nation. We're fighting all of that. I'm curious though, what do you guys think about this? What steps can we be taking to educate and empower gun owners and non-gun owners alike? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. I've also included a link in the description so you guys can head over and check out the polling information for yourself. And while you're down there, don't forget to get subscribed and hit the bell to be notified when we release new videos. I want you guys to know that I really, really genuinely do appreciate you watching and being part of the conversation. As always, thank you all for watching. We'll see you soon.